Hey guys, I'm going to do a quick um, run through of how to download the slides for this week and how to download the PDF of the book Love That Dog, which you will be reading for this week's activities. So if you go to our PowerSchool e-learning page, again, we have all the directions of how to download the slides into your iPad correctly um, for this week. Um, the first thing, please make sure you're logged into your Google with your BSD100 account. Otherwise, you will not have access to this week's work. Okay, and then you're going to be clicking that highlighted link. Okay, so see, it's saying I need permission because I am not in the correct BSD account. So I'm going to switch my account. You shouldn't have to do this. You should already be automatically logged in like that but make sure you're logging in with your BSD100 account and then it will have you make a copy of this week's document, ELA week of April 20th. Next, make sure you're now opening this in your Google Slides app because it'll be so much easier for you to complete the activities on. So I'm gonna click open in the top right hand corner. It'll open up my slides for me in here, okay? And now I have all my work for the week in this one place. Okay, so if you look through the slides, we have our office hours for the week. We have the breakdown of the focus and standards we will be working on this week. We have our cute little dog slide um, with the book we'll be reading, Love That Dog by Sharon Creech. And I'm going to fix this why because it's bothering me. Um, then we have our agenda for each day. So if we're looking at today's agenda, it says number one, click the link to read Love That Dog. So you once you click that spot, you're gonna have to click open link probably. And I would suggest um, downloading this PDF into Notability. It might be easier then. Um, if it lets you do that, um, that way you have it all in one spot and you can highlight and whatnot on it if you want. Um, but if I'm just looking at it here, some people were having trouble finding what pages you had to read. This is like a novel in PDF form. So it's just like all those pages at the beginning of a book. You have um, kind of like um, copyright pages and then you have a table of contents so you need to keep scrolling down until you get to the pages you need to read so this is the first page you need to read um, the there's not page numbers at the bottom here but this is technically page 7 of the PDF um, so it says you have to read September through October so this book is broken up into um, journal entries that are written on specific dates so I'm going to go through the pages that you will be reading for Monday. So you have to read this page, September 13th, September 21st, September 27th, October 4th, October 10th, October 17th, October 24th, and October 31st is the last page you have to read. Okay, so um, if I go back to the slides here, um, remember it said I have to read pages 7 through 15. So pages 7 through 15 are those September and October dates I just showed you. Okay, um, And then you have to answer the questions for the reading, then there's a journal entry, and then you have to do 20 minutes of independent reading. So if we look at the next slide, it's having you go back to pages 7 through 9. So in the top left here, it also shows the month. So if you're looking at all the September entries, it's those three pages, page seven, eight, and nine. So you can just look at it that way if you want. Um, but if you go back to those September pages, you read these questions and answer them. And then the next slide is the October pages. So the October pages were pages 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 of the PDF. So it might be easier just to look for any pages that have the October date, an October date in them. Then you're going to answer these questions. Then there's a journal entry that you're kind of going to be doing some thinking and writing in your own response, in your own kind of personal um, connections. And then you have your reading log for the day. 
And that is all for Monday. And then this will be the start of the next day's agenda. Let us know if you have any questions. Okay, you can message us on PowerSchool, but hopefully this will help you get started on this week's work. Bye.